When you go to the store and want a bottle of water, and there are a dozen of choices on the shelf, how do you make your choice? Do you look for a certain price point? Or are you looking more for a certain taste? Or is it just branding for you? Well, in today's video, we're going to analyze and rank the best bottled water brands on the market. Different types of water. In September 2007, the UK Parliament passed the Natural Mineral Water, Spring Water and Bottled Drinking Water Regulation to protect consumers from fraudulent mislabeling of bottled water. The regulation clearly defined three categories of drinking water. First, natural mineral water. Second, spring water. And lastly, bottled drinking water. Now, what we'll do in this video is try to have some fun and rank the world's most popular spring and natural mineral water bottled water brands. Ranking system. So how should you rank these brands? Well, the best way to get an unbiased opinion is to refer to the World Health Organization's ideal mineral composition. We'll be using their guidelines from a paper published in 2005 as our benchmark. If you haven't seen the breakdown we've done for that report, we suggest you check it out in the description below. Although an ideal water composition was not supplied in the paper, a recommended quantity of each mineral per liter was suggested. All right, now let's create a ranking system. A point is given for each time a mineral is above the ideal composition. And because it's easy to go below, let's give it another point if the mineral is within 50% of the threshold below. Best water. The ideal composition based on the World Health Organization came out to have higher amounts per liter for potassium, calcium, magnesium, and sodium compared to iron, zinc, copper, and iodine. Starting with our first contender, the world's most popular brands Evian. In its mineral composition, we can clearly see that the calcium is above the ideal composition. Also, magnesium is within that 50% mark. We'll accord it two points. Let's take a look at another world famous brand from the French Alps, Volvic. In this label, it seems that there are no elements that fall within reasonable ranges. So no points will be awarded to this brand. Our third brand is one of the world's most expensive ones, Fiji. We also did a deep dive about this company's history so you might want to check the video down below. First thing we notice is the silica amounts are unusually high compared to the other waters on our list. However, this mineral is not considered essential. Since Fiji extracts their water from an aquifer, this explains these higher amounts. That being said, the content of magnesium and sodium grants Fiji water two points and puts it right up there with Evian. Voss Water is a very controversial brand. I mean, they did a great job in their marketing to really target that luxury market. But when it comes down to minerals, let's keep it real. Almost no traces of minerals. We're gonna have to give Voss zero points. Now let's get into these more UK specific ones. Buxton is a very popular brand here and its mineral content is really surprising. Its calcium, magnesium and sodium compositions are very similar to the World Health Organization's suggestions. And this allows it to clean the top spot over Avian and Fiji with a total of three points. Highland Spring is another go-to bottle here in the UK, especially given its very low price point, priced at only a quarter of a pound per 500 ml. Unfortunately, in terms of mineral content, we're going to have to give it only one point. Our last and final brand for today's video is Harrogate, another popular one in the UK, but you might have not heard of it. These guys are focused on the hotel business. Any big hotel chain you go to, you'll find a Harrogate there. Now let's dive deep into their mineral composition. Similarly to Buxton, its calcium, magnesium, and sodium content awarded a total of three points. Interestingly, we end up with a tie between Buxton and Harrogate water for the first place in rankings, followed by Avian and Fiji in second. Now I get it. You probably haven't heard of these two brands that won because you probably don't live in the UK, but make no mistake, we're gonna be covering more videos in the future, which means we'll be covering brands where you live. So make sure to type your country in the comments below. Obviously, the basis of this ranking was based on the World Health Organization's ideal mineral composition. But hopefully, this can serve as a good reference point next time you walk into a store and want to grab a bottle of water. Takeaways. To be fair, let's take a look at another consumer's report and see how our results compare to theirs. A 2009 research shows that Evian is leading the charts and winning the popularity contest with 7.3 million bottles sold that year, with Highland Spring and Buxton following the lead. This is surprisingly similar to our rankings. A richer mineral water, generally perceived as healthier, is definitely a factor that consumers pay attention to. 
However, we all know how the business world works. Not everyone's buying a bottled water brand solely on its mineral content. Price, taste, and consumer habits play an equally important role. And if you're wondering, well, what about those people who are buying those expensive bottled water brands such as Fiji and Voss? These consumers are often looking for a mix between a luxurious feel as well as a smooth tasting water. As we have seen earlier, both of these brands have a really, really low mineral content, which is often referred to as soft water due to its smooth taste. If you pair this smooth taste with an attractive labeling, you've got consumers that can make sense of the premium. An article by The Medical News Today concluded one of the main reasons why people choose a certain brand over the other is taste. To summarize, healthier mineral water usually has a higher mineral content, often referred to as hard water. Now, hard water usually has an unpleasant taste, which is why some consumers prefer to go to a smoother tasting one and often makes sense of why they should be paying that premium price. All right, that was a fun episode. Let me leave you with this food for thought. If the more mineral content is present in the water makes it healthier, well, does that make tap water the healthiest option out there? I am George, and we'll see you in another episode of the Water Series.